Hello, my loves. Uh. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I apologize first and foremost. I know I sound like a shit bag. I know I sound horrible and I probably shouldn't be talking, but guys, it's me. I fucking talk all the fucking time. Am I right? No matter what happens, I don't care how sick I am or how bad my throat hurts, I'm a loud ass bitch. I'm a mouthy ass bitch, so I have things to say, so I'm gonna talk regardless of the fact that I sound like a fucking donkey, but it's okay. Anyways, guys, today's look is the look on my face right now, and I absolutely love the way it turned out. If you guys like this look, give it a thumbs up and share if you'd like. If you guys have any requests for future tutorials, of course, leave those all down below. Subscribe if you're not already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Enjoy! Hey guys, welcome back. So, the first thing we're going to do is prime and set our lids using the Hard Candy Glamouflage Concealer and then setting it with any cream colored eyeshadow. Alright, so next we're going to go into the Love Contours All Palette by NYX. I'm picking up this beautiful transition shade that you can clearly see that I love so much. We're going to go ahead and just blend that into the crease, and I'm being very messy with this because I really want this look to be very blown out. Alright, so now I'm going to pick up the shade Top Notch from my ColourPop Eyeshadow Palette. I personalized this palette myself, so you can buy these individually on the ColourPop website, which I will have linked down below. But I'm blending that into the outside corner and then also into the crease just a little bit. And then we're picking up the shade Stay Golden, which is also my ColourPop eyeshadow palette with a fluffier brush and concentrating that once more into the outside corner, but blending everything out into the crease as well. Alright, so now we're going to go into the Palladio Crushed Metallic Eyeshadow in the shade Meteor. And I'm using my finger because these remind me of the ColourPop Super Shock eyeshadows, which if you use your finger, they come out so much more pigmented and so beautiful on the lid. Alright, so we're going to go into this 26 color neutral eyeshadow and blush palette from BH Cosmetics into that deep plum shade. And we're going to blend that into the outside corner to start the deepening process for this look. When it comes to smoky eyes, as with all my looks, I usually have at least one big, big fluffy brush to blend everything out to make sure there's no harsh lines anywhere. And then I'm going to take this deep matte brown shade and put it into the very, very outside corner and then reapply Meteor because we might have lost some of the pigmentation of the original layer with all the blending that we did. Alright, so I did my lashes, mascara, and brows off camera, so now we're going to go ahead and finish the rest of the eye look. So, the first thing I'm going to do is take a very small, precise pencil brush and blend these shades top notch and stay golden to the bottom lash line. Then we're also going to think we hear people talking in our house. But anyways, going into the stay golden shade, like I said, and blend that into the bottom lash line to smoke out the look. And then we're going to go back into the BH palette, pick up that deep plum shade, and tuck that right into the very outside corner of the bottom lash line. And then to really bring the drama to this look, we're going to take a little, very little amount of a matte black. Any matte black that you have in your collection will do. And we're going to tuck that into the very, very outside corner of both the top lash line and the bottom lash line. Alright, so what I'm doing right now is disinfecting my brushes since I'm done with them using my Come Clean Cleaner. I'll talk more about that in a future video, guys. It's kind of funny what it is. But anyways, I applied my Mega Last Lipstick in the shade Mocha Licious, and now we're going to go into the Spotlight Highlight Palette from BH Cosmetics. From this palette, we're going to pick up the shades Glow and Dream and put this ish everywhere, literally. So anyways, guys, that concludes today's tutorial. If you guys enjoyed it, if you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you guys in the next video. Love you guys. Bye.